Dearly beloved, we are gathered here in the sight of God and in the presence of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. Marriage is an honorable state instituted of God, blessed by our Lord Jesus Christ and declared by St. Paul to be honorable among all men and women. It is not therefore to be entered into unadvisedly or lightly, but reverently, soberly, advisedly, and in the fear of God. Let us therefore, under the seriousness of the act, invoke the divine presence upon this occasion. And I want to ask the question now, who giveth this woman to be married to this man? We you do. do. <laughs> Do you, Mr. Scott, take this woman, Miss Weaver, to be your wedded wife, and do you solemnly before God and these witnesses that you will love her, comfort her, honor and keep her in sickness and in health, and that forsaking all others for her alone, you will perform unto her all the duties that a husband owes to his wife until God by death shall separate you. I do. I do. <laughs> <laughs> to you, Miss Weaver, take this man, Mr. Scott, to be your wedded husband, and do you solemnly promise before God and these witnesses that you will love him, comfort him, honor and keep him in sickness and in health and that forsaken all others for him alone, you will perform unto him all the duties that a wife owes to her husband until God, until God by death shall separate you. I do. I call, take thee. I call, take thee. Taryn to be my wedded wife. Taryn to be my wedded wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better. For better. For worse, for worse, for richer, for richer, for poor, for poor, in sickness and in health, uh, in sickness and in health, okay. to love and to cherish forever, to love and to cherish forever, according to God's holy ordinance, according to God, according to God's holy, uh, I had a shine moment, according to God's holy, uh, <laughs> holy ordinance, and and there too I pledge myself to you, and there too I pledge myself to you. All right, so Taryn, I Taryn take thee. I Taryn take thee. Carl to be my wedded husband. Carl to be my wedded husband. To have and to hold from this day forward. To have and to hold from this day forward. For better. For better. For worse. For worse. For richer. For richer. For poor. For poor. In sickness. In sickness. And in health. And in health. To love. To love. To cherish forever. And cherish forever. According to God's holy ordinance. According to God's holy ordinance. And there too I pledge myself to you. And there too I pledge myself to you. But I now ask you to pour and blend your sand together. As these two containers of sand are poured into the third container, they symbolize the coming together of the two of you as individuals, as well as the joining of families and friends. Just as these grains of sand come together to make beautiful and unique patterns, may your life together be forever blessed by the other uniqueness that can only be truly seen when contrasted against each other. For as much as Carl and Taylor have consented together in holy men, Holy wedlock, and have witnessed the same before God in this company of witness, and that you have given their pledge each to the other, and have declared the same by giving and receiving a ring, and by joining hands, by the power invested in me in the state of Texas, and as a minister of the gospel, I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may honor your God. Thank you.